I, I've been listening to a lot of audiobooks and, yeah. and watching a lot of YouTube. And for me, like the whole marketing psychology and, and why things work the way they work. Okay. This is what I live for. So the past year, we have been doing this like an hour a day. Yeah, at least. Sometimes oh. more for me because I, I get yep. to listen to it while I edit. And we just so, go. Yeah, yeah. I, I love these these audiobooks. They're godsend. But one of the, the most favorite things that I discovered is like Hotmail was one of the first emails. So AOL's email was the very first email that everybody knew about, right? So they, but they had the whole, you have to sign up and have an AOL account. Right, right. So you, it was initially free and then, you know, so AOL was very much like a, a tight knit, you know, like company lockdown. Uh, yeah. But then Hotmail came along and they decided to offer it to anybody with a browser, you could have Hotmail. You don't have to sign up for AOL or anything else. I, think I remember that, yeah. Maybe just Yahoo was out. I know there was no Google, Yahoo right? was out. Yes. AOL, there was no Google Yeah, so yet. Yahoo was the search engine and AOL. Cities. Yeah. And AOL was the company, you know. And by the way, I, I didn't read this in any of the brand books, but now thinking back, mm. Do you remember like shopping at Jewel or any store? Like literally the cashiers next to them had the, the AOL discs. CDs yeah. and they were just giving it out. Yeah. That, that That's brilliant marketing. It's like everybody goes to the store right. and it was free. So yeah, of course you took it because yeah, you heard about the new thing, computers that are coming out. How am I gonna use it? You know, while well, AOL, I put a disc in it, it'll tell me how to set it up. So yeah. they were the first to step up and be like, hey, this is free. We'll walk you through it, you know. The whole dial-up thing anyway so going back to yeah so going back to hotmail hotmail was the first one that said you don't need to be tied to aol you just need a web browser no kidding. yes and the way they advertised it is that they they were the first ones to put in the signature do you want your own free hotmail account they were doing self-marketing they were doing self-marketing yes oh. so whoever you sent a hotmail to it was in your signature because okay. at, at the time people weren't like replacing anything right? Right, right so you just click on it to find out what this hotmail thing is about and how you could also get your free email yeah so that's brilliant right there so i i def i have it in my signature any you know like my website mm -hmm. my mm -hmm. instagram mm -hmm. you have it on yeah. yours you know so that's free advertising right there so i think anybody can take advantage of that